Hello YouTube, how are you guys doing today? <clears throat> I am proud to finally say here we come to MLB The Show 17. I'm very excited for it. This is the first time... Uh, this is the first time I've played an MLB The Show game here on the PlayStation 4. The last one I played was... 14, which was on PlayStation 3, I believe. I do not remember playing, recall playing one here on the PlayStation 4. We're going to start off with Road to the Show. I have not played a single game here on 17 yet. All I've done was turn menu music, turn all music off. That way we don't have any copyright issues. It could be fun. It's also 10 after 11, so it is a little late. So some of my um, batting and just other things may not be as sharp as normal. It'll be interesting to see. Um, we're gonna select new because we obviously baseball didn't do 16. is more than a game. Baseball bonds families. It can lift a nation out of dark times. It reaches across cultural divides. It. Not Ever changing the game and its lexicon. Oh my, that's a Ruthian style blast. Volume on that. Go with current. Custom. Um, normally I play shortstop and all the other ones, so we're just gonna go with what I know. The five flex points. Speed. Perfect. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, we're just gonna go central because I do live in Michigan right now. Go with my name because this is me. To try and create me as if I were to play bait. Oh. R2 is done. That's interesting. Probably. No. Okay, now, unless something really changed, there's no way they're gonna have my last name. There's just no physical way, possible way. Because of me. Got some weird ones in here, though. Some very weird ones. Flint. I don't know anyone with Flint as a last name. Saying. Okay. And they do not. Not. Not a surprise. We'll just leave that blank now. And we'll go with 10, secondary position, outfield, right, right, and this is going to be Florida. That's where I'm from. Oh, well, I can only pick up. Yeah, it is what it is. Physical appearance, body. Kind of looks like this. Okay. 
let's see. Hair, this is where things are gonna get. I've had numerous hairstyles across life, as many of you guys know. What the fuck? Uh, see? Now this is, oh my. Now. I definitely could, but I don't want. Oh, faux hawk. It's jet black. Ooh, no. And I, not a facial hair guy. I, don't, I physically cannot grow facial hair at all. If you guys can't really tell, actually, I've, I've gone a few days without. By a few, I mean nearly a week. And a week, about three. How long has it been? Yeah, about a week. Animations. These all look similar. If I were to ever be a catcher, yeah, batting stance. Hmm. See, now when I, when I swing a bat, I don't take a large. That's about it. Hmm, let's see. What do we got? What do we got for miss? Okay, let's go with that. Yeah. Never was an Edwin and Carson Incarnate the young guy. They really, he's the only Indian that they have though. Paul Santana. Let's just go with King, King Griffey. Equipment. Mm, we'll go with long sleeves. Jersey sleeve length long. They don't really look different. Don't have a lot of glove choices yet. Go with actually let's go with black and green. Homage to my friends over at Vex.
Rotate. Mm. So that doesn't look bad. Mm. Curve semi flat. I run had both. We'll just go with normal. This one will be. There we go. <laughs> the... <laughs> nah. Just go black and green for everything for now. Black graphic. Green. Green. black okay batting gear all right say we're done only took 12 minutes to get this far guys could be a great video could be a long video welcome to the show journey begins here at the bones county event opportunity to have mlb scouts grade your individual skills on it to the true 2080 scale these grades along with your perform out Though encouraged by many to approach scout day just like any other workout, these players know it is anything but that. Here we are warming up. Getting good stretched out. The prospects warm up and stretch before the first test, which will be the 60 yard dash. While its purpose is to evaluate foot speed, it also gives amped up young players a chance to outrun run? their nerves. Like we ran good. Maybe. Probably not. After an anxious wait, a player is called to put his plate skills on display. Scout day coaches do what they can to ground and focus the player for a stock-defining moment. Yeah. Yeah, I, I know how it hit. Let's just kind of warm up, though. Oh. Most of these prospects have played in games that were attended by a major league scout or two. But today, there are 41 major league scouts get in warmed attendance. Up a little bit. That's a pop fly to foul ball. And a strike. Oof. Another strike. Okay. This this is the first time I've actually played a um or not first. This is the first time in a few years I've played. So I kind of gotta get used to them again, used to the game again. I feel like jumping right into it probably was not the best idea, especially at 11, 11 o'clock at night. Who knows? Right there. See. Yeah, let's just take a few more, a few more hits. And... 
probably start evaluation. That was not very far. I'm a shortstop, so. Contact is not good. Contact is not good at all. I'm, I'm just fouling everything off. A bit better. A little early. There it is. I'm falling center. Oh, off the wall. One more, and then we're going to go to eval, and then foul ball. You know, do Okay. Okay. Draft stock is not going anywhere right now. Hard hit, but foul. Not even very hard hit. These scouts are probably like, dude, how did this guy make it? Especially after that one right there. There it is. Draft stock's going down though. They'll see me when I field. They'll be like, oh, hey. This guy's a phenomenal fielder. I'm just consistently off balance. There it is. Down the third baseline. And a foul tip. Okay, okay. There we go. Right to the shortstop, though. That would have been a ground out. That was definitely a strike. That was bad. As was that. A fielding that coach bad. preps the player to showcase his defensive skills. This will be the last chance the player has to make an impression on this day. In the big leagues, pristine defense is a must. The players know that an error-free showing would be the benchmark. Why did I just throw to home? Okay, that was not my fault. Not my fault at all. There it is. Now we got it. Okay. I think we'll take one more, then we'll be able to go. That was a bad throw. Never mind. I think we're good, though. Ground balls to my left. There it is. Ground ball to my right. Okay. Bad throw, though. One more ground ball to my right. There it is. Fielding double plays, okay. Okay, that was not, like, that was weird. There we go. We got a good one there. See if we can get one more. Nice. Field double plays from second basements. 
I have to get to the bag, is what you're saying. Nice. See, told, told you, fielding's gonna be where I'm gonna get it at. And he's out. And another double play from second. When it's over, some scouts come down to make personal contact with a player of interest. This is a marketplace. Stay humble early on. Okay, let's see. Current scouted. Ooh, contact was bad. Okay, things were rough there. 6.55 seconds for the fit of the 60. Not that that matters or anything. A promising young baseball talent receives a call from his former high school coach, who has assumed an advisory role until the player sees fit to take on a sports agent. In the aftermath of a scout day, players are anxious to learn what impact their performance may have made. Modern media offers an unprecedented glut of feedback opportunities. But wisdom would suggest a young athlete focus on what is ahead, what is in his control. Random storytelling behind me. Okay. Let's um, try and get on base once or twice, 54 overall. Hopefully, things go well. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Today, we get the ball rolling with an intriguing matchup Thanks. on day oh, one. We are starting in that. Stepping in, number 10. He stands number in for the 10. first time in this one. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Line to the right side. And that's in there. Base hit. And they'll put the brakes on at third. Runners at the corners with nobody out. Yeah, and scouts are going to really like this at that. So many young players want to do too much with the pitch. Trying to pull everything. But he waited until the ball was deep in the zone. And he went with it to the opposite field. It's great to see a youngster who uses the whole field up there. I think that's what every major leaguer here. needs to learn. Well, he's got himself a little bit of a jam right here, Matt. He's got two on. We'll play ball. Just pitch the contact, get the double play here. Very it's good. a cold strike, the throw. Ball's there, oh, and he I... is out. Good throw. That was bad. Ready for another chance? Bryant Acho. 0 for 1 Bryant. for him here in this one. Acho. Hit on the ground out to short. Fielded cleanly. Throw gets him two down. So oh, I got caught stealing once. That was bad. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Number 10. Number he singled 10. his last time up. Now here's a swing and a high pop up, drifting into shallow right field. Bruno will call him off as he makes Darn. the catch and the side is retired. So it's no runs on a hit. No. Yeah. Digging in for his second at bat. Dirk Howry comes into Dirk this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. My Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Chopped weakly to the left. He's got it. The second, but they throw it away. Oh, that's going to hurt. 
And they won't get him as he's able to advance from first to third on what would serve. The dog is in the background behind Digging him. in once oh, again, number 10. number 10. One for two on his line so far in the game. Liner towards second, but this is going to be hauled in out there at second base for out number two. Digging in and looking for more, Mario First Macias. He's one for two in the ball game. Mario Macias. Ground ball to second. This could be two. To second for. Relay to first Ooh. in time, Ooh. and just like that, the side is retired. Four to six to three. They roll it up to get out of the gym. Digging in to try it again. Batter, number 10. Number He's 10. got a hit in three at bats to this point. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Story racing back. Over on bye bye ball. And it's gone. Yeah, and the scouts love the fact that he has the power to go bye deep. Bye but I'll tell you ball. what they love even more a hitter that can rise to the occasion with runners on base, a hitter that can. Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with the victory and look on to the next one. What the heck was that? that? That was weird. I'd say that was very well done. Oh, um, I was in a very precarious position. Well, you can move closer to further up the bed. And this afternoon's game ends 7-3. to three. The Central get the win despite three errors in the field. Darren Whitehead worked only three innings in the losing effort. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Here Vaskersian. This has been school. a presentation of First MLB The, the Show. To find Central out more, Sports head on over to theshownation.com. Three errors. They left 14 runners on base. For the home team, three runs on eight hits. Turn it there. I'd say that went well right there. First AB, or first um, first at bat, got a single, and then, you know, blew out, and lined out, and then a home run. I would say things went well so far. Could be very much worse. Than the, um, As the draft down. nears and teams begin to identify prospects they may target, a game of dreams also becomes a game of dollars. Nice, um... A ball player must keep the game in his heart, but his mind on the game, or he won't be a ball player long. Okay. That's like the gameplay option. That's what I needed. That is what I need. And can I train you? We'll start training early. Beautiful. And play the second showcase game. 
500 average on um, one error, no stolen bases. Let's try and get this on. Um, And we are in the field first. Now in the box, Michael yeah, we Lee. Have a out at first That's right. or third. Michael Lee. Lee. Here's the 0 1 pitch. Swing and a high pop up back onto the outfield grass now. Number Four. 10 is there to make the catch, and the side that, is retired. Very, so they get a man to second here in the top half, flyout. but he's stranded there. Into the box now, number Got 10, and he's ready to take his first cut. Number 10. Ooh. Swing and a miss, really and he's behind 0-1. That. Well, that's a high pitch he's swinging at right there. Even if he makes contact on that, mat, I think it's a pop-up. He's probably not going to drive that ball. That ball's so high out of the zone. Swing and a liner. Oh, and he misses it. I would say that went well. That, base hit, that was a base hit. Yeah, he's had to showcase to show what he can do. And if he could string a few ABs like that together, he's going to see his stock rise and keep rising. Yeah. Nothing spectacular, Nine just a eight. solid base knock. Center fielder, Lindsey Cox. Yeah. Here's the one and one pitch. Now a swing and he pops him up. And I believe, yes, the umpire signaling for the infield fly rule. That didn't make it off the pitchers down there. That was bad. Yeah. Now batting, Sebastian batting Santiago. Nine. Designated hitter, Sebastian Santiago. One and two, here it comes. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. Donnelly moving to his left, and that's the second out of the inning. Yeah. Really should have stopped him midway through there. Okay, Digging in for his second at bat, Orlando Brown. Two's all over the place. Two Orlando on, two out, and of course, Brown. here in inning number two. Hit back up the middle. And that'll get through into center field for a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. Ready for another chance. Kurt Dyson, 0 for 1 Second here in the early going. Kurt Dyson. Runners on his way to third, and he'll step off. And they've got the runner trapped in a hot box between second and third now. So one run better. here. Yeah, Digging like in to try it again. Daniel uh, Hernandez, Daniel. 0 for 1 for him here in this Daniel. one. Play here. here comes Hernandez. the nothing in two pitch. On the ground, up the middle, reined in. And the underhanded throw gets him for the out. But they won't get two as he beats Darn. the relay okay. to first. Main attempt. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Joey right Donnelly. Fielder. He's 0 Joey for 1 thus far. Donnelly. Now the 0-1. Hit to short. Scooped up. And the throw is wide as it pulls the first baseman off the bag. Okay, we can force Digging out. in and looking force for more. Roy Barlick. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. Had two errors. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. And a close play at second, but the throw does beat him, and the side is retired. So one run on two hits, one error in the inning, and a couple of men left. Now batting, number 10. First pitch of the at bat. Heading out towards shallow right. Donnelly is under it. Makes the play one away. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Ryan Coker. He doubled earlier and carries a two for two line into this appearance. To short. Throw to first gets him. So the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Digging in once again, number no 10. He's number one for 10. two in the ball game. Mine to the right side. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. And the throw will go to second as they get the force out. I'm getting a steal here. Ready for another shot now. No Lindsey Cotts, 0 for 2 here to start the Lindsay afternoon. Cox. 
piece. Here comes the 1 1. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. Beautiful. And it's far too there. late as he steals second with ease. Yeah, that's just what you want to do in a showcase. Show off your strength. The scouts know he's fleet of foot. They've seen the numbers. But to see there that speed is, in action will do nothing but help his stock. It just, it just took good timing. Popped up, falling for it. Tyrone makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now at the plate, Sebastian yeah, be Santiago, as he'll look to bring home that tying run hitter. from second with a base Sebastian hit into the outfield. Santiago pulled high in the air out to left field. Hernandez moves over. He makes the play, oh, and time. that'll end the inning. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. Riding in once again, Art Connor. Shortstop, Art Connor. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Now, this is hit not all that hard out to second. He will go to shortstop covering, and they do get the force at second. That was not an easy play. Oh, we, got, we got the guy at second. He, he took my glasses. Ready once again, number 10. He's working on a number one for 10. three thus far. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0 and 1. Now that high fastball right there, it looks like you can just reach out and touch it. It's right at eye level, and you go to swing, and it's by you. It is the biggest deceptive pitch, I think, in the game. 1 and 1. 1 and 1. Guess they change up inside. From the windup, the 1-1 one, one pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Arias is over, looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Oh. Digging in, Martin Montano comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. He's Montana. set, and the 2 1 pitch. Grounded back up the middle, and that'll get through into center. So there's your possible go ahead run on base now to lead off the inning. Stepping into the box, Go number there. 10. Number he got 10. under one and popped out his last time up. Like sports Here's the first pitch. A fastball yeah. off the plate away. It's ball Take one. <laughs> the 1 0. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over really toward like foul ground. Now. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. On curve away. The one and one pitch. Nope. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Yeah. Bouncer down the line. That goes foul. Two strikes on him now. Well, he fouls off that fastball right there, and you wonder, does he love his fastball enough to come back with it three times in a row? Yeah. Here's the 2-2 two -two pitch. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Well, he didn't get the result. Oh. Now at the plate, number 10. He struck number out 10. swinging in his last trip to the plate. Splitter, Splitter swung on and missed 0-1. No ball. One strike. Oh, this guy doesn't even have a fastball. That was a bunch of off speed. The 0-1. Line drive oh. to center field. <laughs> but sadly for him, this will head straight to the center fielder as he puts it away without One much for trouble for the second right out. Stepping in, Jason Tyrone. Baseman, number three, Jason Tyrone. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Runner goes for third. Chopped weakly to the left. And the throw is not going to be in time as he's able to reach base safely. That's rough. Point one for the century, one for six. Here now, our final line score. That was goal. bad. First. That was bad, bad. Bad, 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 bad. It was bad.
That was just not good. Showcases and scouting activities having wrapped up, all attention turns to the imminent main event, the MLB draft. Lifelong dreams of being a pro ball player will be realized. Young dreamers will stand on edge to find out where will be the first stop on their road to the show. Welcome back to the Major League Baseball First Year Player Draft. Rounds one through four are complete. And we will now begin the round fifth five. round. Are you kidding me? The first pick is officially on the clock. With the first pick in the fifth round, the Minnesota Twins select Josh Emery, okay. a relief pitcher from the international region. With the second pick of the fifth round, the Tampa Bay Rays select Von Nowakowski, a starting pitcher from the international <sighs> region. With the third pick in the fifth round, the Cincinnati Reds select Justin Oof. Fry, a relief pitcher from the East Region. With the fourth pick of the fifth round, the San Diego Padres select Marty Lopez, a starting pitcher from the Central Region. With the fifth pick in the fifth round, the Atlanta Braves select William Chu, a relief pitcher from the International oh, Region. With the sixth pick of the fifth round, the Oakland Athletics select Michael Lee, a catcher from the East Region. With the seventh pick pitcher. in the fifth round, the Arizona Diamondbacks select Sherwood Mendel, a starting pitcher from the Central Back Region. Pitchers. With the eighth pick of the fifth round, the Philadelphia Phillies select Daryl Beard, a shortstop from the International Region. With the ninth pick in the fifth Me. round, the Milwaukee Brewers select Stefan Delgado, a second baseman from the Central Region. With the tenth pick of the fifth round, the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim select the shortstop from the Central Region. Yeah. Going to the Mobile Bay Bears, most likely. The awaited moment arrives. Many players will forever remember every detail of this conversation and moment. Okay, there we go. In the days and weeks that follow, teams work to come to terms with the players they have drafted and get them signed. In most cases, rookie contracts get done in a fairly straightforward manner. And with that, players and organizations alike are happy to have their team and get the season underway. My elbow looks very pointy. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we got drafted. I'd say things are good. Training, we have some. Get some contact in. There we go. And I think that's going to actually probably do it for this video. Yeah, I think that's actually going to do it for us, guys. Thank you for watching this video. Quick recap. Well, drafted by the Mobile Bay Bears here in Double A. Going to be a fun year. I've actually, I'm very excited for this. Um, 
Road to the Show, or this MLB Show 17 game, this version of the show, wow, we're struggling, hang on a second guys, I know I'm not looking at the camera, I'm sorry, there you go, I am very excited that for this game, this nice to have a new game to play. Obviously, I haven't played a baseball game in a couple of years, so it is going to take a little bit to get used to. However, this could be fun. I'll probably have a second one going at some point, somewhere. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Peace out. And stay classy, YouTube. Bye.